Hey guys, so I'm doing this braidless method for full locks that allows you to do full locks very very quickly. When I tell you quickly, this is super fast because you know when you're doing locks, if you've done it on yourself or on somebody else, you know they can take hours because you have to usually you would braid the hair first and then you're going to crochet in the hair and then it's just a lot of process so this method that i'm showing you today is going to just speed up everything and you can do this if you don't know how to braid as long as you can wrap hair you should be able to do this technique so i'm currently preparing the hair as you can see and um, i'm going to show you the hair that we're using today which is also going to make this process even much much quicker and the hair we're using today is from Ultra. I'm going to be using a springy Afro Twist 3X um, in color 1B. So um, the length is 24 inches and this is the hair, this is the package. So that's what we're going to be using today. So the texture of this hair is so beautiful for locks. It has a very natural texture. I'm going to show you guys in just a second. So this is what it looks like when you open it up. You can see it has some like really nice um, kinky curl on the ends. So what I'm going to do today is to actually um, let those kinky curl on the ends be kind of like the curls on the ends of the locks. So you're going to see. So the hair is already pre-separated as you can see me doing right now. So it's just going to make everything easy. So we're just going to use one strand of each separated um, strands. So yeah, this is a technique, you just grab a rubber band, make sure you oil it like I showed you in the beginning. And you just want to um, put the rubber band right there and make sure the length of the hair is like uneven. So that way one, one side is longer than the other and the long side is what we're going to use to wrap. So you just place the hair over and you're just going to wrap that rubber band around her natural hair. And we're placing the hair over so that way it kind of hides the rubber band when we start to wrap um yeah so i figured this was easier and um you just push down the rubber band like this okay to make sure your, your part is nice and you know clean and you know showing and just use your shining jam to like twist or roll the hair um like that so we're gonna take the short strand and just hide the natural hair inside of it like this okay and then we're going to take the long strand and we're just going to start wrapping so just wrap it nice and easy like this. So um, yeah, pretty easy, okay? Like when I was doing this, I was like, oh my God, this is so fast. So I was working on this technique on my mannequin and the idea just came to me like overnight. So <laughs> yeah, that's what I'll be doing sometimes. <laughs> so I just wrap all the way to the very ends and I'm going to leave those kinky curls on the ends out, um, as you can see. And um, yeah, so to secure the lock, you wrap back up and you're just going to make a knot. So because of the texture of this hair, it locks really quickly. So you don't have to worry about the hair unraveling, okay? So just cut off any excess and just, um, yeah, you have some beautiful kinky curls on the ends like this. So I'm just going to massage the lock, as you can see, to make the texture even more pronounced. And there you go, okay? This lock is very soft very lightweight you can twist it you can bend it let me show you very flexible like if you can do this to your lock then you know that it's not heavy at all so this hair is amazing for this hairstyle so yeah just keep on watching um i'm going to show you guys how to take it down in the end of this video so make sure you watch this video all the way to the end because i know you guys will always ask me how do you take it down especially because this hair your hair is not braided so i just want you guys to see that you can actually Take this down, you can install it, and you can take it down safely. So keep on watching all the way to the end, and um, enjoy!
guys when I tell you this hair is lightweight this hair is lightweight let me show you like this hair is super super lightweight it's almost like feather like it's just so amazing so you could use this hair for other hairstyles as well so it's not limited to just locks you could do twists you could do ponytails you could do all kinds of different um, hairstyles for your natural hair using this hair because it's just going to blend if you have a natural hair texture like she does or like type 3, 4, whatever natural texture that you have for like, you know, people like us, people of color. So <laughs> yeah, this hair is going to work for you. So I'm just in the front now and um, keep on watching. Yeah, she wanted to show you guys that this hair is lightweight. Like, she's not feeling any weight. Like, she could move her head. She could put her head down. She could shake it. Like, how? what else do you guys need to know that this hair is just the beautiful texture? Weight is just so light. Like, the texture is beautiful. Ah, I really love this hair, guys. So make sure you check out Ultra Hair and try the springy afro twist. This hair is gorgeous. I'll probably try it with twist next time. But yeah, this is me just styling it up. And um, yeah, I love it. And she loves it too. Thank you for watching this video and um, stay tuned. I'm about to show you guys how to take it down. I know where her natural hair ends and I also told her, her I stopped her um her natural hair about two inches before transitioning into leaving the curly kinky hair on the ends. It's just I just cut off that very ends where the kinky hair is and then I just started to unravel back up until I finish unraveling the whole lock and then you're going to see me just find her natural hair from you know the shorter piece that we wrapped around. And once you find the natural hair, you can just easily take out the rubber bands and that's basically it. <laughs> 